CEO, to our channel, to our corporate and social responsibility, and to the diversity of our business. It's been a kind of busy 317 days, but who's counting? We're singularly focused. Every single one of us wake up every morning thinking about print and personal systems. And we go to bed thinking about print and personal systems. And we think a lot about supplies as well. Financially, we're doing what we said we would do. We've delivered three quarters in a row of EPS to our shareholders, returned more than $1.8 billion to our shareholders in the form of dividends and share repurchases. We're taking profitable share where we choose to play, all of us collectively choosing to play in the profitable part of the market. And we're reducing non-revenue generating costs of more than $1 billion to allow us to channel that money back into our business to invent, to create entirely new categories to enable long-term success for all of us. So, how is that manifesting itself and what does it mean for you? I believe, and I'm sure many of you agree because you've told me so, that we have the best product lineup in decades. It's frankly unrecognizable from four years ago. We're delivering on our core and we're gaining momentum by driving innovation and differentiation. That's the key. But we're also setting up for our growth expectations and our future. Our net promoter scores are up seven points since separation and we're reinvesting printing with an entirely new portfolio of page-wide laser and inkjet printers combined with today's acquisition makes us the undisputed powerhouse in the industry. We're providing you with the industry's most secure and innovative management, services and solutions portfolio. We debuted the world's first 3D printer designed for short run production as well as prototyping. And in doing that, we're laying the foundation to disrupt a $12 trillion traditional analog manufacturing industry. It's really exciting. And one of the team are having just a hell of a lot of fun reinventing personal systems. We're outperforming the market, we're taking share in the premium space from the fellas down in Cupertino. We have great revenue opportunities for all of you. And we're doing this with, again with incredible innovation like the Elite Book Folio, the X2, the X3, and the world's thinnest laptop. It's so thin, I'm holding one up now, you can't see it, right? <laughs> the Spectre 13. It's so easy to do product reveals. Here it is. And our work on the channel never stops. We're providing you with the innovation, the programs, and the tools that we know you need in order to win. We're increasing our omni-channel capabilities and we're transforming hp.com. But it's not always about just what you do, it's also how you do it. Sustainability and diversity serves as a guiding principle just as it has for the past 76 years when Bill and created the company in the way we operate and how we do business. Whether it's from what I think is quite frankly the most diverse board in corporate America all the way through to the announcement that we pledged to achieve 100% of renewable energy usage in our global operations and 40% of that to be done by 2020. Together, HP and our partners have accomplished amazing, truly amazing results in the past 10 months. Let's just see a glimpse of what we've achieved together.